Look at that. It was enough to force employees out of their office seats, enough to shatter the windows of a nearby ground level apartment. There was fire coming out of both of them. After not one, but two manhole covers exploded on Columbus Ave, the other on Isabella Street, literally steps from District 4. We just heard the explosions from the firehouse and came out. Firefighters responded before the calls came in. They came upon thick smoke and flames. There was electrical faults and stuff going on underneath. The force of that build up enough to blow one manhole off completely, the other came ajar. The source of the fire electrical in nature, which changed firefighting methods. We use a fire and out ice. It's a gel mixture. Our hazmat companies are trained in it. And what it does is it flows in and, and forms a bond around the arcing and electrical wires to make it safe to stabilize. Eversource responded and after a check of nearby offices for smoke and carbon monoxide, firefighters returned to District 4, now running on a generator as theirs was the only building to lose power. I'm sort of faulting, I'm sure. Um, I, I don't exactly know. That's for them to determine. But fortunately, no one was injured when that giant heavy manhole cover went flying. We're live in Boston, Julie Lonchek, WCBB.